Developing tonight, the University of Utah gymnastics program is under investigation. The head coach accused of being verbally and emotionally abusive to athletes. New specialist Debbie Worthen joins us live tonight. Debbie, what triggered this investigation? Well, Dini, according to our partner, the Deseret News, which broke this story, five former athletes, four parents, and two staff members came forward saying that Coach Tom Farden is, in essence, too mean. Now, the U says they are taking this investigation very seriously. We talked to two former athletes tonight who are quick to come to their former coach's defense. The women's gymnastics team is known for filling the Huntsman Center and for their success as a Division I program. And since 2011, now head coach Tom Farden has been on the floor working with the award-winning team. The U put him in charge back in 2020. I really have nothing but positives to say about Tom and his program. That's Sydney Soloski, a Red Rock, from 2018 to 2022. She's heard about the allegations and is quick to share her experience. I had nothing but a great time. I have great memories, made great friends, learned a lot of lessons. Same thing for Crystal Issa. I look back gratefully, um, even when he was tough. There were a lot of moments where I am not a very intrinsically motivated person and I think I needed that push even if I didn't love it in the moment. The U released this statement regarding the allegation saying the well-being and safety of our student athletes are of the utmost importance to the university and the athletics department and we are committed to our student athletes feeling respected, supported and safe. The U says an outside independent review of the program is underway and while both Soloski and Issa respect the opinions of others, both say they graduated with great memories and life lessons. I think he helped me grow as a person and as an athlete, and I got everything I wanted out of the sport, and I can't thank him and the staff enough. I think Tom is a fantastic individual, a fantastic coach. Now, the U told me they will release the findings of that investigation in the next couple of weeks. In Salt Lake City, Debbie Worthen, KSL 5 News.